Good morning, TradingView users. This is Tim West. I thought I would review the Tesla chart given that it is gapping up to an all-time high this morning. And I thought I would start with my most recent chart that I've published and it relates to the time of the mode analysis. And at the last uh, review, what we noticed was that the time had run out from this rally that started from this low back in May in the sense that uh, the market stopped making new lows, so a new trend started from here. The most number of days, which was 12, built at this specific price that I have outlined right here. The market then detached from that price on this day by breaking out and rallying for these 12 days, topping off, backing down, holding on to this level of 12 and building this consolidation which turned into 15 days which provided a sign that the market was accumulating quite nicely and therefore set up uh, this day here that I've outlined in a circle is a day when the market disconnected from this price which turns out to be about 223 and signified that it would rally for about 15 days from this day being day one, so two, three, four, and so on to here. What I could surmise from that point was uh, we would have some sort of a sideways correction that would take hopefully uh, 15 days uh, or more to build a new accumulation at this level before taking off again. But what's happened is. Um, We've only built so far one, two, three, four, five, six. This day actually is connected to this day also. So seven, eight, nine. There's nine days of this price so far. And the uh, market's just opening now. So um, either way, this entire day here is day one of the new trend but unfortunately it's only nine days so um, given that it's been an entire day above this nine you could conclude that this is day one of a nine day advance so you can look at it from that perspective and we can make measuring targets take the midpoint of uh, the, the mode of the last correction measure up to here and copy that with the copying tool right here that's called the clone tool and then drag it and place it so that it matches the number of days that gives us a target of about 296 297 uh, the number of days is 9 this being 1 so to um, you can use the time tool or we can just count it out on our own there's a very nice uh, date range tool here you can use. So I'm just going to grab it, click it. It'll tell me when it says nine bars, which is also, of course, 11 days in that instance. Dragging it to get a little larger. And then I'll pick that up and move it over. So I picked up the wrong. And I'm going to grab that again. So we can place that and uh, signify where nine nine bars is with the first one being. Uh, I know this is going painfully slow. I'm sorry, but when you record the entire screen and you have a multitude of windows open, this is just what happens. So, all right, you can see how hard it is to place that. So we got a nine bar rally potentially going on that started yesterday it could potentially go up to 293. So that's the most aggressive call I can make at the moment and just wanted to share that with you. You can review uh, other videos at YouTube here and also go to tradingview.com and look for me, user Tim West and you can subscribe to my ideas. You can also see all the various indicators that I've created 
and uh, subscribe to them so it can do all kinds of wonderful uh, technical analysis to help you see a chart come alive. So that's it for the moment. I'll get back to you. Look forward to hearing any comments. Thank you very much. Have a great day.